Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for October 27th of 2023 well, it is titled Enki and the Tadpoles. So what do we see here? Well, here on the left hand side, that greenish glow is actually Comet Enki, which is one of the comets within our solar system. And comets have highly elliptical orbits, meaning that they go out to the depths of the solar system and can come in and swing in very close to the sun. Now the exact orbit of course depends on the comet itself. Some go out well beyond Neptune. Enki on the other hand goes as far away as about the orbit of Jupiter. So that's about as far out as it gets is about Jupiter's distance and then it swings in and comes in toward the inside the orbit of Mercury. Now that makes it the shortest period of the recurring comets that we have in the solar system. And its period is only about three and a half years. So every a little over three years, it will come back in. And this image taken in August of this year uh, was a little bit before it reached its perihelion or closest approach to the sun, which occurred just a few days ago. Now, as it gets closer to the sun material is vaporized off the comet and that gives it that green coma we see around it. So that green glow is a halo of gaseous material and often associated with carbon uh, compounds from the comet. And the carbon compounds are what give it that green glow that we see and we often see that with comets. Now on the other side, we see the tadpole, uh, tadpoles, the two tadpoles there embedded within this uh, star forming region are actually star forming clouds within an emission nebula. An emission nebula is one that glows because of the excitation of the gases by hot stars that have already formed, but stars can still be forming as well. And those tadpoles are actually condensations where new stars are in the process of forming. And you can see the tails kind of sticking back away from stars that have already formed further in to the central portions of the nebula. So as stars form, they shape the area of the nebula around them and eventually will disperse it out into space. And here we get to see that nebula along with the comet. And of course, while they look close together, they are actually at very great distances. Whereas the comet is within our own solar system, the nebula is well beyond that many hundreds of or hundreds of light years away from us here on Earth. So that was our picture of the day for October 27th of 2023. It was titled Enki and the Tadpoles. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be mostly a ghostly weekend. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class. <laughs>